Okay, Mr. CV, what happened this morning? <laughs> yeah. Well, we we went into a spot I've been I, I shot my buck in last year, uh, great big ridge system with a cut, and uh, I've got three or four real big bucks on camera in here, and I so I sent Nate up over the ridge while I went to check the camera because I haven't checked it in two weeks. Like Nate usually does, it wasn't an hour in the woods and he was already banging at him. <laughs> He said that uh, he wasn't sure if he'd hit it, found some hair, wasn't sure. And then about 20 minutes later it was, oh, I got a little blood. And then it was, oh God, I got bone, big pieces of bone. So we, ha we haven't taken a quick look at him yet, but uh, we decided, we tracked him, Nate tracked him down where he'd been stumbling and falling. He finally bedded and he crossed into some posted property. Like we always try to do, we went to the landowner, approached him correctly he was super cool i knew who he was so i said well we just need to i think he's in the swamp back behind your your field there and he's like yep go recover that deer for sure and uh we got down in and nate did a couple of turns through the swamp because he's got the big high boots on today and i don't and uh he, he nate got within probably 50 odds of me twice on the third time i heard something thought it might have been a beaver of all things i'm like there's something flopping around right in front of us and he's like, well, I'm like right there. And it was, wasn't 30 yards between us. It was, he was probably laying in the water or right on one of these little humps that's in here. Uh, but he wasn't going anywhere. And Nate put two finishing shots into him, so, or three, or however many went off, I don't know. <laughs> but I think I shot three. <laughs> yeah, it, it's dead now, so we're all good. Now it's time to concentrate on getting Tyler when we get home. Good deal. All I can say, a heck of a morning. Climb to the top of the mountain, like Rick said, and you know it's tough. I, I actually I thought this deer was a little bit bigger than what he was when I shot, but I came over the knoll and see a big buck running. That's dangerous scenario for me. So I saw the antlers and the old 35 whale and started shooting, and uh, didn't think we were going to recover this deer. But patience, slowing down and walking in and knowing the terrain was a huge huge factor um and i got my main buck so all i got is one bonus tag left and i'm tagged out of maine so looking forward for when ty comes home so we can take him out and i'll do some videotaping with him and uh i'm very happy very blessed today got my main buck nice seven pointer very happy and the cool thing is is rick's got him on camera too so that's pretty cool awesome job you know we gotta get him out land owner was great We'll say thank you to him on the way out, but this caps my main season. Uh, got a nice seven pointer with my bow, and I got another seven pointer with my gun. So we'll get him out, and I think we're going to be off to New Hampshire. <laughs>